And uh, Al's right, you know, there's a little uh, lull in the precipitation that's been over in the eastern shore counties for the last couple of hours. So uh, you guys are maybe around 12, 13 inches uh, with this storm over in the eastern shore, as opposed to you jump over on the other side of the bay and you get uh, 20, 30 <laughs> inches of snow in some place. Just an incredible uh, range of snowfall across the region. Let's take a look at Weather 1, and I'll, I'll show you the storm very briefly here. You can see it's circulating off the coast of Ocean City. And uh, just to the left of that on your screen, or just west of there, uh, there's that little lull in the precipitation over in the eastern shore that Al was talking about just a few minutes ago. And it's been there for the last three or four hours. And, and it's a very curious thing. I, I can't truly explain it uh, meteorologically, where you have this band of very heavy snow on the western shore of the bay. And for the last couple of hours over in the eastern shore, there's been nothing showing up. But what we do know that's going to happen over the next couple of hours, everything is going to sh slowly shift to the east. So while it's still snowing pretty hard up and down the I-95 corridor, this is going to make some progress over into the eastern shore. And you can see the snow kind of breaking up a little bit in southern Pennsylvania. All of this is going to drift down to the south. And we think by maybe 9 o'clock this evening, uh, most of this will start to taper off to at least snow flurries. And then it should be gone and off the coast by midnight. But it's a, it's a very interesting uh, meteorological setup with this storm that uh, we're kind of scratching our heads a little bit here. Uh, it's not the typical kind of nor'easter uh, that we would see here in the Mid-Atlantic, that's for sure. It's an interesting storm.